In this demo, we'll show a complete workflow for managing your JFrog services all the way to creating and securely distributing release bundles to target destinations, all part of the Enterprise Plus platform solution. We'll start from JFrog Mission Control. Here we can see a distributed environment that includes two main sites, each representing a source artifactory configured in an HA cluster to share the load and ready for DR, and three edge nodes representing the target artifactory instances, which are the production sites. Artifacts are distributed from source to target. The source artifactory usually represents your development environment, from which you will create and distribute release bundles to your production site's artifactory edge nodes. Let's take a quick peek into one of our source artifactory instances. Our release bundle will contain a Docker image and its corresponding Helm chart bundled into one unit. Here, we'll be able to see our release files from which we would like to create a release bundle and distribute to our edge nodes. These artifacts were previously built and deployed to Artifactory during the CI process and are now ready to be distributed to runtime. Here is our Docker image. Artifacts can come from multiple builds and be located in different repositories. And here is our Helm chart. Now we can move to JFrog distribution where we'll actually create and manage our release bundle. A release bundle defines a secure and immutable collection of artifacts that are packaged together. It groups together the contents that are part of your release, providing the bill of materials for your software releases. Here we can create a new draft release bundle that can be edited, signed, and then finally distributed. A signed release bundle ensures that its contents and metadata are credible and untampered. To create the release bundle, we'll use Artifactory Query Language, AQL, which will enable us to select the artifacts to be included in our release bundle. Notice that multiple queries can be used. Signing a release bundle finalizes the process of creating it. In addition, distribution will trigger the source artifactory to clone the contents of the signed release bundle into an isolated release bundles repository. We'll see this repository later on in the video. Now that our release bundle is created, we can sign it. The release bundle status will be set to signed, and the release bundle can now no longer be edited. And we'll distribute our release bundle to our artifactory edge nodes. Let's open one of our edge nodes to see our release. An artifactory edge node is an immutable, read-only artifactory instance. It supports the distribution process by bringing the release bundle that's being distributed closer to its end users or consumers, essentially making it more accessible. Here we can see the Docker image and Helm chart that we just distributed. Here is our Docker image, and here is our Helm chart. We can also see all release bundles received by this artifactory edge in the Receive tabs in the Release Bundles page. Using the artifactory edge REST API calls, we can retrieve the distributed bundles and drill down to each bundle to view its contents. Finally, let's go back to our source artifactory to see the release bundles repository. The Release Bundles repository protects the artifacts created in the Artifactory source instance by copying them into a separate repository where their contents cannot be edited or removed. And here's our Release Bundle. Saving the Release Bundles here ensures consistency in the artifacts being distributed among target instances. The Distributable tab contains the release bundles that have been signed by distribution and are ready to be distributed from a source artifactory to an edge node. This concludes our screencast. The JFrog Enterprise Plus platform gives you an end-to-end -end pipeline to control the flow of your binaries from build to production, managing your software deployment end-to-end. -end. Visit the JFrog website to learn more and start your Enterprise Plus test drive today. Thanks for watching.